In this video, I'm going to explain steps I follow after putting on a new belt, regardless of the brand. Stick around to the end for a pro tip in determining if your belt needs to be replaced. As always, please show your support by hitting the subscribe button. Belt install tip. Make sure you install the belt properly. When installing a new belt, you need to be able to read the manufacturer's name on the belt. If it's upside down, then you might have installed it incorrectly. I'm not speaking for every manufacturer though. That's just the rule of thumb I've always operated by and it works, so take it for what it is. Why break in a new belt? With my experience, when I take time to break in a belt properly, that belt usually lasts longer. Belts need to wear and mate to the proper angle of the sheaves. This helps for it to wear into the correct friction because some belts can be too sticky while other belts can be too slippery when they're new. So following the break-in process helps that wear to happen under low load and low temperatures. Most people don't realize belts run hotter when first installed and are more sensitive to high loads until they break in. Belt break-in process. Start off with low gear, drive up to five miles, varying your speed with avoiding the going wide open throttle. Once I ran it for five miles, I park it for 30 minutes, and then I repeat the process for another five miles. When varying the speed, I keep it from five to 15 miles in low. The goal of the belt break-in is to achieve a high number of flex cycles under low load while maintaining low temperatures. Keep in mind, not every belt manufacturer requires a belt break-in process or they might have their own. And I suggest using the manufacturer's belt break-in process if they have one. In conclusion, following a belt break-in process helps reduce the risk of premature belt failure. It can eliminate that risk, but it can help reduce it. Pro tip for signs of a bad belt is when you start to feel a jerky or hesitation when taking off. Check out the description of this video for links to all the products we mentioned. Using the links in our description to buy these products helps us to continue to bring you great information like this video. Please show your support by hitting the subscribe button and clicking the bell icon to turn on notifications. If this video has helped you, then please smash the like button and thank you for watching.